Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The engine development has been Achilles heel of Indian aviation sector and its demand is in billions of dollars. At least 41 F404 engines were ordered between 2004 to 2007 for the first two squadrons of LCA Mark 1. Back in August 2021, HAL and G Aviation has signed a deal worth $716 million for 99 F404 engines that will power the indigenous LCA Mark 1A. In future, Indian Air Force will be inducting 6 to 7 or maybe 10 squadrons of this Mark II, 7 squadrons of AMCA. Indian Navy will also induct its futuristic TEDBF fighter jets. Now, all these fighters will be powered by G F414 INS6 turbofan engines capable of generating maximum thrust of 98 kN with afterburner. Now, G is also expecting a contract for a closer of 100 F414 GE INS6 engine very soon. As a part of this deal, G will provide the manufacturing TOT for the engines. Now, US, UK and France have been trying to increase their defense cooperation with India in engine development to tap into the billion dollar requirement of Indian Air Force. India is looking for foreign partners which can fulfill its requirement for engine to power the AMCA, TEDBF and LC Mark II fighters with more powerful engine than the existing F414 GE INS6. Now, before we talk about the G's latest offer for AMCA engine, let's try to go a little back in the history and understand what has gone wrong earlier with India-US cooperation for engine development. Back in 2019, the US Secretary of Defense Acquisition and Sustainment has informed that India-US Joint Working Group on Jet Engine Cooperation within the framework of DTTI, that is Defense Technology and Trade Initiative, has been suspended. The reason cited was that two countries could not come to an understanding of what exportable technologies would be useful to India, which led to challenges in terms of US export controls. Now, if we want to simplify this, US did not want to share technologies for critical components for the engine, which is its core or heart section. Now, as per latest reports from the business world, the US has revived an offer to cooperate with India on development of jet engine technology, which could be used to power India's fifth generation fighter jet AMCA. The G of US has submitted a proposal for co-development of a more powerful variant of GF414 engine with Indian agencies. Yong Ji Kim, G Aviation's Vice President for Asia Pacific Region Military Systems Operation, has disclosed to Business World in an exclusive interview that all technologies previously asked for by the Government of India will be offered. India had earlier sought the core engine or hot section technology for jet engines under India US Defense Trade and Technology Initiative but was turned down. Now, the G's 164 kN thrust variant of F414 engine is called F414 Enhanced Engine and will be the baseline of this offer of cooperation. In the year 2017, the US Navy has awarded General Electric a $114.8 million contract aimed to install new powerful GF414 enhanced performance engine on its existing fleet of F-18 Super Hornet and E-18G Crowler aircraft. The enhanced performance engine includes a new core and a redesigned fan and compressor. The new engine offers 18% more thrust. The existing F414 INS6 which will power this Mark II and AMCA Mark I has thrust of 22,000 pounds or 98 kN and thrust to weight ratio of 9 is to 1. It has a length of 154 inches and diameter of 35 inches. The F414 enhanced engine has a thrust of 26,000 pounds or 116 kN and thrust to weight ratio of 9 is to 0 1. It has a length 
of 154 inches and diameter of 35 inches which is similar to F414 INS6. The enhanced version has same dimension but more thrust as engine allows more airflow into its core. The airflow to the core of F414 INS6 is 170 pounds per second and that of F414 enhanced is 187 pounds per second. Now looking at the specification, we can tell that the engine is matching with AMCA Mark II requirement and no changes would be required in AMCA structure to integrate it. This will further allow to upgrade the Mark I squadron of AMCA and this Mark II with a more powerful engine. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.